<laughs> okay, hi guys, how are you? So we are the Mar Mars Squad and um, our project is... Change the slide. Yep. It's astronaut's personal... Is it on? It's called the astronaut's <laughs> personal computer. And, you know, when you go on Mars, you're probably going to want to have something like this on your hand. So it's going to um, give you all the information you need, so like the contextual information, or uh, it's going to provide you like a communication with, uh, with the Earth, with your friends, family. If you want to like, post a picture on Facebook, you can use this as well. So let's go over the, the, the features we have here. So, but in terms of challenges, we are kind of in both those groups, technology and also journey to Mars. So we designed this awesome product just uh, especially like for astronauts who's going to be walking on the surface of Mars. Um, so this is our <laughs> production version. As you can see, we have two of them here. So that's what it's going to look like. Yeah, this is not a production. This is just those two. Right. And it actually works, seriously. Everything about it, it works. We built everything, all the features are perfectly workless. Okay, let's go over. So now uh, I'm going to show you how it works. So just to, for you to be familiar with all the vocabularies here, so this is called uh, uh, PCA, pers uh, no, APCA, Astronaut Personal Computer. And this is uh, uh, voice command module back. So B B P -E C B P. Uh, yeah, we like the great. I have to turn it on. I have to turn it off. Echo. Open A B P. A P C. Loading astronauts personal computer. Perfect. Hello Mars. It's changing. The feedback is, it works really fast, as you can see on the screen. Yeah. Where am I? It shows you the map of the uh, universe and the point that you are here on Mars. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice rover one. So it's telling me the rover is 300 feet from me. It's not magic. Damn it, who used to That's wrong. <laughs> Localized rover two. Oh. oh yeah, we have an issue here. What's next? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Help. Okay. Help. <laughs> Help. Okay. <laughs> 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 Report. Checking messages. Help. Yeah, okay, well, this is a live demo, so some features are not production ready, but we are almost there. As you can see, this is an almost wireless solution, so it's it's all perfect yeah we can just go over all the screens we have here so we can so, uh, show the weather we can show the time reports you can take a selfie maybe that's gonna work echo open apc loading astronauts personal computer selfie Voila. So as you can see here on the screen, we have a picture. So the idea is the camera is on my arm, I'm doing this, and I go, hey, selfie. We got the selfie. But this is supposed to, yeah, and by the way, we are using the, all the APIs, so we are sending a picture, like as an MMS message to the ears, because the voice communication is not really possible because of this 20 minutes lag, so, so, so only the text messages are really possible, so that's how you can check your um, your kind of communication from the earth. So, uh, hardware-wise, so as you can see, we use not only that IBM's platform, but also we are using IBM's hardware here. <laughs> so it's a professional solution, like military grade duct tape, the best hardware, everything is awesome. Uh, so that's the kind of architecture we. So AWS Lambda, uh, the Alex API. We are using uh, NASA APIs to get some pictures. Uh, like on the surface of Mars, and we use all the Wolfram Alpha uh, APIs to get some uh, like all the time. Oh no! <laughs> okay, we use all these things here.
right, do we have any questions? When can I get one? <laughs> it's a prototype. It's very expensive. <laughs> So if you're going to take this further, what are the other features you'd want to add on to? So I would like add another screen mode, like maybe on a somewhere here in front of my eyes, like kind of Google Glass, <laughs> or uh, this is a touch screen here, but I know in a, like in a real like a, with all these heavy glass, it's impossible to use a touch screen. That's why we decided to use voice commands. And uh, so this is just an output, and the input is your voice. And yeah, I would definitely use something different than Alexa. I mean, this is not a truly like text, uh, voice to text to send that's not working properly. So, uh, but other than that, it's almost perfect. Uh, <laughs> maybe this cable is an issue and it limits the range. <laughs> but that can so be that sorted. Add longer cable. Yeah, longer cable is definitely a solution here. <laughs> What you guys can't see is that, is that it's uh, duct taped it is. down here, so. Because we are professionals. Come on, if it wasn't, then that would be an issue, but it's not now. I like the creative use of the Starbucks uh, box, too, by the way. I love it. Thank you. All right, guys. Thank you very much.